Hello guys, today I am going to talk on how to install subject tool and its uses and uh, how can you take on subdomain or do subdomain takeover. So let's get started. So to install subdomain takeover or um, the subject tool, so you need to go on sub C GitHub. Uh, this is the official page for subject tool. Uh, the, this guy names name is Lukasi Kik. I don't know how to pronounce that. So let it be. Oh, the, the guy, by the way, guy is very good. Uh, I don't know why I'm touching him. I'm not in his level. So to install the subject tool, you need to first install that Golang. Just install apt install colon install. I already installed that, so I'm not going to install it again. It's clear. So to install subzi, just copy the first line of installation, and then paste it. I also already installed subzi tool, so it takes time. Don't worry, uh, mine just completed the first. So to to use subject tool now we need a file of subdomains so to get the subdomains file you have to use HTTPX and subdomain subfinder and uh, MS tool so I will talk on that later so suppose we have that uh, subdomain uh, subdomain contains subdomain uh, subdomains that file uh, the file so we just go into the directory so here is the HTTP uh, name that uh, is the file that contains subdomains there are many and I will count it how much they are uh, count uh, uh, there is 1100 so to use sub g tool for subdomain take over just easy command yeah, maybe there is no no there is no shown to use that sub g tool just sub g icon targets the file that contains Uh, URLs having this uh, sub, uh, sub I don't know file that contains having subdomains and then just have to be see if you want to save that output to iPhone A that uh, sub dot txt I will go we will get that output so let's get started this subdomains are not vulnerable that's why it's showing not vulnerable if it's vulnerable it will show vulnerable so let's wait We got something. Uh, it's showing it's vulnerable. Let's check if it's vulnerable or not. So you guys don't do that. Do that. This not found. Oh, there are also uh, contains false positives. this one uh, 
we are accepting that risk. So also not going to work. So discussion. So we are leaving that here. So this is what it is. If you get a vulnerable, then you can try further testing. So thanks for watching.